In this tutorial, we are going to rotate triangle XYZ 180 degrees around the origin. For any 180 degree rotation around the origin, you should first write down the location of the given points before they are rotated. Point X is located at 3, 2, Y is located at positive 7 and positive 2, and Z is located at positive 3 and positive 8. Notice that all of our values are positive because they are located in quadrant number 1. To rotate any object 180 degrees around the origin, simply change all of the signs inside your parentheses. Because all of our signs are positive, you must change all of them to be negative. So point X will become negative 3 and negative 2, Y will become negative 7 and negative 2, and Z will become negative 3 and negative 8. Let's observe why this rule actually works. Each quarter turn is worth 90 degrees, so we have to make two 90 degree turns around the origin. And if you take a look right now, notice that point X is located at positive 3 and positive 2 on the Y axis. And after we make two quarter turns, notice that the X value is still a number 3, however it is negative 3. It was at positive 3, and that same arrow, when it is rotated, is pointing at negative 3. So the x value still stays 3, it just has an opposite sign. And take a look at the arrow that is pointing to the y value. Before we rotated our triangle, it was pointing to positive 2. If we rotate it 180 degrees, that same arrow is still pointing to the number 2, but it becomes an opposite integer, or in this case, negative 2. So whenever you are rotating any shape 180 degrees, all you really have to do is write down the coordinates where the shape is located before you rotate the shape, and then simply write the opposite integer or change the sign of all of your numbers inside the parentheses, and that will tell you where the shape is going to end up being located after you rotate it.